hi everyone and welcome back to my channel today i will be showing you four fun glitches in star stable that i like to do and you can do them right now in 2020 first glitch is actually in Dino Valley and it involves the portal that you get in a quest with Evergrey that takes you from Epona to Dino. So if you haven't done that quest, you won't be able to go through this portal or do this glitch. And basically, you go up to the portal and you just kind of walk through it. And what this glitch does is you can take a non-cold resistant horse through here and when you come out the other side of the portal, not only is the fog gone, but you can actually run full speed as if it is a cold resistant horse, which I find really helpful when I'm coming to do bone hunting or fossil hunting. And I don't want to switch horses because I can just come here real quick and go through the portal to become fast again. I will insert the coordinates of the portal in case you're like me and have very bad navigation skills. If you're like me, then you probably really hate the Star Stable saddlebags. I absolutely despise the way they look on the horse and how a lot of times they don't even appear to be connected to the saddle and this really frustrates me because I love to have a running pet but then you have to have the saddle bag with it. Well this next glitch actually shows you how you can have your running pet out and then no saddle bag. What you're going to do is open up your inventory and start by putting both the saddlebag and the pet of your choice in. And then you'll let the pet walk or run. You'll click that function. And then once it's out, you want to check that it's out. And then you can, you start by starting to drag the saddlebag off. And once you're dragging it, press the letter C on your keyboard and then just put it back in your backpack like normal. And then you'll be able to have your pet running alongside you with no ugly saddlebag, as you can see. And I use this glitch every single day because I just hate the look of the saddlebags that much. But I really love having, for instance, my new panda ray with me. And it's just been a really nice glitch to have. The third glitch is in Fort Pinta. And you actually want to go to the castle wall sort of area. Right up through here. You want to go all the way up the stairs. And you want to keep going until you reach the section of wall that breaks off and leaves kind of like a gaping hole and then turn around and look at back at the stairs and you want to go onto the stairs and then slowly like move off of them to get onto the like railing the stone railing like I'm doing here and then once you're on that, you just want to try and go through the wall. It might take a second, and you might have to kind of lean in towards the actual stairs. But then once you get through it, you actually fall down underneath the building. And this is a really nice like hideout spot. Like If you wanted to play hide-and-seek here, or just mess around with a random glitch, you can kind of go wherever or a lot of different places in here, or you can just try and get stuck if you like to do that. I mean... You can also go through the wall near where the stairs are above you and 
go outside the building onto this little cliff ledge right by the stairs that lead you down to the beach and you can try and take a cool picture here or just mess around like I said but it is kind of cool to check it out and yeah <laughs> The last glitch I'm going to show you is a western dancing glitch that you can do at Starshine. And basically to do this glitch, you need to go over to the dancing area pavilion and walk your horse right up to it on the stairs. And as you can see, the dancing symbols actually show up as if you're on the dance floor. And once you're up there, you want to press X to get off your horse, and you want to leave your horse there, and you can continue to go on the pavilion, or you can actually leave and run wherever you want, and then stop and dance. So I'm going to go to the arena and dance there. But also keep in mind, if you get back on your horse and leave, the glitch will go away. So anywhere you go, you'll have to run to get there. And the glitch, actually, you can dance in one place or move to another just by pressing the dash with the circle to quit button. But the glitch won't go away, which is really nice. And as you can see, I'm just breaking down some really nice moves here in the arena. No big deal. It's really fun since the last dancing glitch at Moorland did get patched. Luckily, we do have another glitch like this one as a backup. And you can also spy on people or you can see my horse right there just standing around in the pavilion. That is it for the video today, guys. I may do a part two in the future, but for now, thanks for watching.